Top story here at 5, talk of a new city ordinance meant to stop the sale of tobacco products to anyone under 21 continues and soon the city council could act on it. 17's Christian Goeno begins our coverage tonight. Well, the city attorney's office tells us that the city of Bakersfield currently counts with a tobacco ordinance that restricts anyone under the age of 21 from purchasing, possessing, or even using tobacco products. But that same ordinance currently does not have a tobacco retail permit requirement. Deterring the sale of tobacco products to minors has been steadily dropping in Kern County. But city leaders in the Safer Neighborhoods and Community Relations Committee think more can be done by adopting a city permit to sell tobacco, a move inspired by a county ordinance with one goal in mind. How easily accessed tobacco products are to our youth. Under Kern County's Tobacco Retailers Permit Ordinance, tobacco vendors must pay $135 annually to the County Public Health Department for a retailer permit. Additional yearly monetary penalties for any violations committed are incurred. These violations are caught by underage county decoys employed by the county health department. We send them into tobacco facilities that are permitted by our department every year to see if they're able to access tobacco products. And unfortunately, many times they are able to purchase those tobacco products. According to data from the county public health department at the program start in fiscal year 2016-2017, 135 violations were reported. The next fiscal year, that number dropped below 100 violations, and in fiscal year 2018-2019, only 35 violations were reported. Shopkeepers that sell tobacco products say they don't mind another annual fee. Bakersfield County needs the money to stop those illegal tobacco sales. We are happy to help. But for other shopkeepers, they believe current rules are more than enough. For the minors, uh, we're 21, we don't sell, right? Whatever the rule is, the law is, that's okay. It's going good, right? Yeah, well, this is still very much up in the air, and council members Arias and Gonzalez did request that the conversation around this ordinance be continued at the next city council meeting. For now, reporting in downtown Bakersfield, Christian Gulano, 17 News.